In today's video, we'll be reviewing the latest 2024 Nissan Rogue. Welcome once again to Sim Action Auto Review Channel. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and turn on the post notification, like, share and also comment down below. The Rogue is comfortable and functional, but several competitors are more appealing and provide greater driving pleasure. The 2024 Nissan Rogue's most notable feature is its exceptional comfort. Not only does it provide a smooth ride, but it also has some of the most comfortable seats to ever cushion our backsides. The Rogue, powered by a 2.1 HP turbocharged three-cylinder engine, aims to strike a mix between quick acceleration and efficient fuel use. Unfortunately, the outcomes are mixed, which is exacerbated by the fact that the two-row ute is a complete bore to drive. Despite its unassuming attitude, the 2024 Rogue will please those seeking a stress-free ride from a beautiful compact SUV. Nissan updates its compact SUV for the 2024 model year giving the Rogue a glitzier grille, new wheels, and a reworked back bumper. Inside, there are a few small changes, but the most significant addition is a 12.3-inch touchscreen. Not only does it replace the previous 9.0-inch unit on the SL and Platinum versions, but it also introduces a Google-based infotainment system and accompanying apps. Nissan Connect services now feature a three-year trial period, a significant increase from the prior six months. The price of the 2024 Nissan Rogue ranges from $29,810 to $40,090 depending on model and options. The mid-level SV model provides the best value for the price. It has features like 18-inch aluminum wheels, an 8-way power-adjustable driver's seat, a 360-degree exterior camera system, and Nissan's ProPilot Assist semi-autonomous driving mode. And we choose for the SV Premium package, which includes a panoramic sunroof, a power-operated rear liftgate, roof rails. During our initial test drive of the three-cylinder Rogue, we noticed that it felt more energetic than earlier models, which were powered by a non-turbo 2.5-liter four-cylinder. However, at our test track, its acceleration was not significantly faster than the 2021. We tried with the 2.5-liter four-cylinder. The turbocharged three-cylinder engine accelerated the Rogue to 60 mph in 7.8 seconds, a 0.4-second gain over the 2021 model. The Rogue provides a comfortable ride for commuting and road trips, but its laid-back cornering style hasn't won over our staff. The Rogue's turbocharged three-cylinder engine is rated at up to 30 metric PG city and 37 metric PG highway. Going with all-wheel drive decreases those predictions to 28 metric PG city and 35 metric PG highway with the top-spec platinum trim lowering the highway number even further to 34 member P. On our 75 meter of interstate fuel economy route, our all-wheel drive platinum test vehicle returned a disappointing 31 Pamatris. The Rogue's interior takes stylistic ideas from both the Altima family sedan and the Sentra compact sedan. Rich-looking design details such as thoughtful storage cubbies, a bi-level dashboard, and a squared-off shift knob boost practicality and add to the interior's modern flair. Cloth seats is normal, although the mid-range SV model can be ordered with optional faux leather upholstery. A touchscreen infotainment system is prominently displayed on the dashboard, the Rogue comes with an 8.0-inch screen, but the SL and Platinum variants come with a larger 12.3-inch screen with Google-based software. It's the first Nissan with Google built-in, 
which provides a plethora of apps and a more streamlined UI than the conventional system. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are standard, but premium options like in-dash navigation and a Bose sound system are optional. The Rogue's interior is also rather excellent, with appealing materials and current technology. The top two trims include a massive 12.3-inch touchscreen infotainment system with Google-based software, while all models include a variety of driving assistance features. The luxury SL and Platinum Rogues come with genuine leather, the latter having a semi-aniline hide with quilted stitching. Available amenities include three-zone automatic climate control, heated front seats, and a heated steering wheel. The SL and Platinum variants both come standard with a 12.3-inch reconfigurable digital gauge cluster. The Rogue also features a big 10.8-inch head-up display and a wireless smartphone charging pad. The 2024 Rogue includes a slew of standard driver assistance technology to help it compete with well-equipped rivals like the Toyota RAV4 and Subaru Forester. Nissan's ProPilot Assist Semi-Autonomous Driving Mode is available as an option for the Rogue SL and standard on the Platinum model. Standard Automated Emergency Braking with Pedestrian Detection Standard blind spot monitoring, rear cross traffic alert, available adaptive cruise control with semi autonomous driving mode. Nissan's standard warranty coverage is uncomplicated, although competitors such as the Kia Sportage and Hyundai Tucson provide longer lengths of protection and, in the case of the Hyundai, three years of free regular maintenance. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel like the video, share, and also comment down below. Thank you.